Here's our buoy 10 update for Sunday, August 16th. Uh, it was a little bit better bite for me today, and what I did is I started up at the bridge on the Washington shoreline and trolled downstream with the ebb from the bridge all the way down to the fort. And I stayed in that 40 to 50 feet of water, and we really didn't see any fish being caught until we got down to about the fort on down to the bottom of the sands. Now that could have been because of the part of the tide we were at, but uh, we started seeing some fish caught, got a double on Chinook, which is always fun. And then we jumped over to the red line on the Oregon side from buoy 20 on down. And there was an okay bite there, but really that has been the most consistent bite all season, uh, at least for me, for what I've seen here, that really seems to be the most consistent spot. Whether it's outgoing or incoming, there's always fish being caught there, it seems. Now it may not be red hot, but they're there. Uh, today the wind picked up big time and we were very fortunate to have a incoming tide this afternoon here because if it was outgoing it would have really lumped it up and made things difficult even with the incoming tide we had about a three to five foot wind chop going with the current coming back to the dock so it was really lumpy out there um, hopefully that'll lay down a little bit tomorrow but it's gusting at least 40 right now it's cooking when you get white caps here in the marina it's a windy day so uh plan for tomorrow i'm gonna get started at the same time at seven and i'm gonna jet upstream i might start a little bit above the bridge on the washington side the washington side seems to be holding a lot of schnook and there seem to be a few more coho on the oregon side because there's a decent snap there at hammond too but uh blades were it for me the half brass white other half with the red dot that one got more bites than any other rod and really we only had two or three bites on bait so blades were the ticket for me today and we'll see what tomorrow brings because yesterday it was all bait and today it was mostly blades so we'll find out what happens tomorrow thanks again for tuning in we'll see you then out